My name is Sue Rogers and I'm the president and founder of Rough Love Rescue. So Rough Love Rescue basically is a nonprofit 501c3 dog rescue, cat rescue organization that was founded in 1999. We are a no-kill rescue. We help abandon, neglected, and abused animals and get them back into good health and then find them good loving homes. He's a good dog. Yeah, so he had two rescues that wanted to keep him, that wanted to take him. And when they found out he was heartworm positive, they both backed out on it. Basically, um, in a year's time, we can, last year, for example, we rescued over 400 dogs and placed them in good homes. It just is going to depend on the space and the amount of foster homes that we have on how many we can take in. We're basically a small rescue, but um, we grow with the amount of foster families that we have. And then the turn, if we can get animals in, get them healthy, and then find homes for them, then the more we do that, then the more we can take in. Rough love just does an amazing job with taking animals that would otherwise have no chance at life. Uh, the homes they get, sometimes I want to put an application and ask if the families would adopt me. They're just amazing families. Um, they go above and beyond with the dogs that they adopt. They stay in touch with us and if something happens, we always take our dogs back. We don't ask questions, we don't judge. We just want our dogs to always have the best life possible. I think one of the great things about our fostering and our adopters is most of us stay in touch with our dogs. I mean, I still get pictures from dogs I adopted three and four years ago. And that's really what keeps you going, seeing how happy these dogs are and knowing that they would not have been around if it wasn't for Sue Rogers and Rough Love Rescue. When I got there with Levi, he went right up to Mike and just, I mean, that was it. He sat there yeah. with Mike the entire time. Yeah. They love each other. They still, I mean, they tag me on Facebook pictures. They text me pictures. He's just absolutely in love with it. You can tell from that picture. Yeah. <laughs> um, I think one of my favorite stories um, of one of my fosters, um, he was, he had severe mange. We, of course, got him the medical treatment he needed. He got an application for um, a new home. We went to meet the family and it was an instant match. The family has a son with Down syndrome and he had a dog previously his entire life and the dog was his constant companion. And when he and Levi met, they decided that they were best friends. It didn't take a day, it took just a few seconds. They were immediately buddies. So one thing that makes Rough Love what it is, is all of our volunteers and fosters. And without all the amazing people that we have at Rough Love, there is no way that we would be able to save as many animals as we do. They give of themselves so much I'm just so, so thankful for all my volunteers and all my foster families. The financial donations are what keeps us going, that keeps us to be able to take that next dog, that next dog. Um, we are so, so thankful for all of our contributors and people who understand what, what we're doing um, is helping an amazing group of dogs. So I want to thank all the people that support us. Right, Lava? Right. Thank you. <laughs>